Bitch, all she do is act bad. We don't catch feelings, all we do is pack bad. Sean Diddy Combs, the musical mogul once hailed as the king of hip hop, now finds himself in the eye of a dark storm that threatens to dismantle his empire. What started as whispers has erupted into a chilling outcry with over 120 individuals accusing him of S.A. Each harrowing testimony adding to the weight of a case that grows more damning by the day. Diddy, once untouchable, now stands at the brink, his public bravado faltering and his eyes filled with fear of going behind bars. Before we get started, make sure to leave a like and comment on this video. Also, if you'd like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone 15, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck. Old buried secrets are coming to light. The current flood of accusations has pulled back the curtain on long buried secrets. Attorney Tony Busby, representing many of the accusers, has described the case as wide-reaching and systemic, hinting that others within Diddy's orbit could also be implicated. According to sources, some of the claims stretch back to the days of Bad Boy Records, with parties allegedly devolving into exploitation and abuse, behavior shielded by wealth and power. The resurfacing of these old cases reveals a pattern that some claims were long enabled by Diddy's business associates and employees, who either looked the other way or participated in covering up the abuses. This new wave of lawsuits adds to a growing number of legal battles that threaten to drown Diddy in litigation. The breadth of these allegations is staggering, and as each day passes, more victims seem willing to step into the spotlight to share their stories. For Diddy, the fallout from these cases represents not just a legal battle, but a public relations disaster that is threatening to bring his empire crumbling down. 50 Cent's explosive docuseries on Diddy the storm of allegations surrounding Diddy is escalating, and 50 Cent is fanning the flames with a bombshell docu-series. The feud between the two, which dates back nearly two decades, has only intensified. In September of 2024, Netflix officially picked up the highly anticipated docu-series directed by Alexandria Stapleton and produced by 50 Cent, centering on the criminal allegations against Diddy. The docuseries promises to delve deep into Diddy's controversial past, shedding light on both his criminal entanglements and the dark side of his fame. Despite Diddy's plea of not guilty to all charges, this documentary could hugely tarnish his legacy, presenting details that have remained hidden or underreported. 50 Cent, known for his relentless trolling of Diddy on social media, is now pushing the boundaries of their feud to a much broader platform. By turning the scandal into a cinematic spectacle, 50 Cent seems poised to control the narrative. Netflix, seizing on the public's curiosity, acquired the project, recognizing its potential to captivate audiences. Behind the scenes, the creators emphasize that this series aims to give a voice to the voiceless, focusing on the victims and their stories. This isn't just another hit piece on a fallen mogul, it's an expose on systemic abuse within the entertainment industry, and Netflix is banking on it to deliver major viewership. Hollywood distances itself from Diddy amid the allegations. As Diddy's legal troubles mount, the reverberations are shaking the foundations of his public persona. Hollywood's elite, once eager to go to Diddy's parties, are rapidly distancing themselves from him. Social media feeds that once proudly featured prominent figures with Diddy are being scrubbed clean as celebrities rush to delete posts, tweets, and photographs linking them to the embattled star. Major influencers, former collaborators, and A-listers have quietly unfollowed Diddy, sending a strong message of disassociation. Celebrities like Usher, Pink, Megan Fox, and even Naomi Campbell have removed posts showing them with Diddy, perhaps out of concern for their own brand image. The backlash in the industry has been swift and cold. Diddy is now being ostracized by everyone. Moreover, brands associated with Diddy are reevaluating their partnerships, fearing a backlash from the public. The risk of association has grown too high as allegations of sexual abuse, trafficking, 
and more continue to dominate the headlines. $50 million bail rejected. Recently, Diddy's defense suffered a critical blow when his $50 million bail bond proposal was flatly rejected by a New York judge, dashing any hopes of pretrial release. His legal team had constructed a comprehensive bail package that included house arrest under 24-7 surveillance, restricted travel, and a GPS monitor. They even proposed that his Miami mansion, valued at $48 million, serve as collateral. However, the court was unyielding. Prosecutors argued that Diddy posed a significant flight risk and remained a severe threat to the community. The claims were stark, branding Diddy as a serial abuser who allegedly used his influence to manipulate, threaten, and silence witnesses. These accusations, coupled with years of alleged sexual abuse and human trafficking charges, left the court wary of releasing him despite the extravagant bond offer. His wealth and global reach also contributed to the court's concerns, making it easy for him to evade justice. Diddy's repeated denials of wrongdoing did little to sway the judge's decision. His team immediately filed for an appeal, but the judge maintained that the severity of the charges warranted continued detention. The legal war continues as his attorney scrambled to get him out of jail, but the prosecution's hardline stance shows no sign of softening leaving Diddy confined until his trial unfolds. Dangerous jail and suicide watch. With his bail rejected, Diddy now finds himself in the Metropolitan Detention Center in Brooklyn, an environment notorious for its poor conditions and history of violence. For a man accustomed to luxury, this marks an unimaginable fall from grace. The MDC has long faced scrutiny for its subpar treatment of inmates, including overcrowding, inadequate medical care, and frequent reports of violence between prisoners. Diddy's legal team is expressing concern for his safety, as the star is a major risk in this dangerous setting. Adding to the gravity of the situation, Diddy is reportedly on suicide watch. This precautionary measure reflects the immense pressure he's under, given the severe charges that could lead to decades behind bars. The psychological toll of being held in such a hostile environment is apparent, and the combination of isolation, shame, and fear has led to concerns over his mental state. With the walls closing in and the prospect of spending years, possibly the rest of his life incarcerated, the mogul's days of glory are truly over. And with this, we've come to the very end of this video. Tell us in the comments below what do you think about Diddy going to trial? Let us know your thoughts on the whole video below. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video, and if you're new to this channel, Make sure to hit that subscribe button for all of our future content. Thanks for watching. Until next time.